today our lesson is going to be about multiplication. We are going to start by talking about the basic concept of multiplication. First, what exactly is multiplication? Well, it is the basic idea of repeated addition. Here is an example. Repeated addition is just adding the same number over and over. Here we have some stars. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We have twelve total stars. You can write this by grouping them into columns. Just drawing a line in between them. You have four groups of three. So you would write this as three plus three plus three plus three equals twelve. You can also sort them into equal groups. Each group has the same number of objects. There are two groups, the pink circles, and each group has four turtles. You can do the repeated addition by just adding them together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There are eight total turtles. So you can do two groups of four equal eight. That is how you would write it. Here I have two groups of apples. One, two, three, one, two, three. These two groups are the same. There are three in this one and three in this one. So we have two groups of apples and there are three apples in each group. So let's count them and find out how many we have all together. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six total apples. So you would write this by two groups of apples and there are three in it equals six. So two times three equals six. We can make six another way. We can have three groups. Here we have three groups of cherries. There are two in each group. So I have three groups with two in each group. Let's see how many we have total. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six total. So we would have three times two equals six. Three groups of cherries with two in each group equals six. As you can see, you can make different groups or ways and still get six. You can do this with other numbers as well. That is the basic concept of multiplication.